Today, we're at Elgin Middle School, where we'll be teaching the sixth graders the do's and don'ts when meeting an unfamiliar dog. And we've even got a few tricks up our sleeve. Hi. Hi. Nice, nice to, to meet you, Megan Burton. Nice to meet you, Edward. This is Caxon. Hi, Caxon. Can I go ahead and pet him? Sure. Caxon, how are you? Good boy. Nice well, hey, first of all, my name is Edward. Uh, I own a doggy daycare, boarding, grooming training facility in Austin called Mud Puppies. I'm also on the board of a couple of, uh, of a rescue and then a couple of other organizations. And then I'm also Caxon's trainer. So I'm a dog trainer as well. Dog daycare. And I see about 50 to 60 dogs a day. And even the ones that I see every day that I know, I'm probably still not gonna do this to. But he, him and I have such a close bond that I can do this to him and he's not gonna have a negative reaction. So here's what you're not supposed to do. And what most of you would love to do if you love dogs, and I even get adults doing this. So exactly what you're not supposed to do is this, like, oh my God, it's a dog! Oh my God! Oh my God! Oh my God! Oh my God! Oh my God. Oh my God. Uncomfortable. Right here, the way that I'm I'm positioning myself is non-threatening to a dog. If I sit if I sit next to you and I'm just sideways, I'm not threatening. If I come at you like I did to him and I'm like, hey, oh my god! You're like, what is this guy doing? That's exactly what they're thinking when you guys do it. What I did was to get him to be comfortable with glasses, I literally would do this. I would I started off by just doing that and removing the glasses. And he wouldn't have a negative reaction. So I'd give him a treat. Then I'd go back again, I'd hold him there for a little bit longer. You notice I was holding them. So then I'd give him another treat. And so I'd start rewarding him little by little, and then like tiny baby steps, to the point where now I can leave them on him. And he's not gonna care. But he's focused on me and he's looking at me because he knows there's a, there's a, there's a treat coming. He knows that this is a good thing. I'm not gonna hurt <laughs> him. Hey, see, he wants that treat. Oh, good boy. See, he wants to keep playing. And that's what I want. I want those good behaviors. See, I'm, I'm rewarding him for these good things, and he knows what gets a reward. So he's gonna keep doing it. Good boy. Good. You wanna play for the Good boy. That is Caxon. And so I will also. There's also he's got trading cards. So I know that sounds funny, but whenever we go on visits. Uh, every single one of the patients that we visit with will get a Caxon uh, therapy card. And on the back of the story, you'll see he's got his little Superman costume. <laughs> uh, and a round of applause because they took time out of their schedule to come see us today. Okay? So, yeah.